So walking through the Palm Beach International Boat Show from that angle, you see the beautiful 30 foot power play, brand new boat. We had to take a look around, let's jump on board. So taking a look from the exterior, you're gonna see the sunshades that they put up here towards the bow and also towards the cockpit. Beautifully done, providing tons of shade, really nice faux teak throughout. Kind of this faux teak looking flooring as well, which really complements it and doesn't require the maintenance of real teak. So let's jump on board and take a closer look at all this. They actually extended the Armstrong ladder to be able to connect it like so and added a grab handle on the back. So that fits comfortably in the console. You have twin Mercury Racing 400s right here and an entryway right through the transom, which also offers a backrest to close this thing off if you'd like. Coming to this area, you have seating both port and starboard, but if you crack this thing open right here, you can lift off an additional seat, which comes in just like that. Obviously with that backrest in place, gives you a full bench all the way across. Close this thing up, just like this. You can see the bilge access right under you, Eric. Let me go ahead and pop this thing out. Uh, there we go. Nicely finished compartment. You have your bilge actually hidden underneath there so the water filters through, but you actually have it covered so you have a beautifully finished bilge area which doubles as storage. Excuse my voice, it's a little raspy because I just lost my voice, but we're pushing through this sucker. So very nice powder coated piping throughout here. You have a small live well if you wanna do a little bit of fishing here. JL Audio speakers throughout and cool little features like this right here. A step to be able to jump out of the boat while you're at the dock and you also have that on both sides. You can see they have the grill set up. This boat is absolutely perfect for entertaining and it looks pretty sharp when you're out at the sandbar as well. You can see you have the teak accents with the release marine helm chairs. They also have the full dash like so, complementing that. The decking material with the iPhone holders, USB port right here, Garmin MFDs, <clears throat> zip wake head unit, fusion head unit, and your vessel view. So right under here, you actually have a little trash compartment, which is nice to be able to throw that stuff and keep it out of the way. And come forward, and let's pop open this console door right here opening up the head. This opening is unique to the 30 power play, giving you a great access point to get in. Check out this little faux teak piece right here, opening up the rigging, which they have tidied up a ton. This thing looks phenomenal, super clean and easy to get to just about everything right through here with a large opening. Then you have a lot, you know, good size headroom right here to use the facilities if you were to need it. Close this up. Like so, really nice forward bench seat contoured to your backside. So really nice right here. And then they did the forward seating a little differently now. They actually left that bow open and I'll show you why in a second, but I'll show you the storage here first. And these I believe are removable if you did want to open this whole area up. So this owner actually has a trailer with a staircase up on the front. So what Mr. Mason did was created a staircase for them, be able to jump in and out like so when the boat is trailered. And then it's actually nice to have if you're just, you know, using the anchor or just need to get in and out of the boat, but beautifully done all the way around. Like we're used to seeing from Tom Mason here at Power Play. Tons of storage, nice fit and finish throughout. Really nice boat. We've been on this thing out on, the, out on some rough seas and it's handled itself very well. But as you can see, it's built for entertaining. This is the Rum Runner model. They also have the Walker's K edition, which is more the fishing oriented boat. So come see this thing at the Palm Beach Boat Show or call Mr. Mason at Power Play Power Boats for more information.